Okay, I'm fresh out of ideas. You know, what bothers me most is that while we're sitting here, he's out there digging up all sorts of stuff. Calm down, Teasel. You're going to burst. He won't lead us to the treasure. No one will as long as that big door is still locked. All we have to do is make sure we get rid of him before then. Right? So what if he digs up a few scraps here and there? He can keep that garbage. All we're after is whatever's behind the main gate. Right, Teasel? You know, you're absolutely right. Then that will be our new plan. We'll wait for him to open the main gate. We'll let him keep whatever he finds until then. He'll see. It'll be the Bonds who have the last laugh in this game. That's right! <laughs> Thanks, Wiley. You're pretty cool. I don't believe it, Mega Man. It's a red refractor. With this, we should be able to repair the, repair the flutter. Hooray! Let's go. Let's go fix the flutter. You know I don't get paid for these okay, ads. Okay. Twitch just does them. I'm going to fire up the engine, Mega Man. You grab that blue lever there. Gotcha. Do you see any cutesy avatars around here? No. Yep, on my mind. It worked! You did it, Rolf! We're flying! We're flying! Well, I still have a lot of work left, but we should be able to get around the island at least. Nice. And you'll be able to reach that cave now, too. Nice! Let me know when you want to start a dig at the cave, and I'll take you there any time. Bless you and your weird bolted on cap. Hmm. Hey, bats. There, she's finally fixed. Well, it's not 100% fixed, but we should be able to get around the island. She'll be able to take us to the other subgates. Or the closer woods. Starting to get a little worried, though. Seems like things are starting to get out of hand. I'm not sure, but I think Gramps is nervous about something, too. Why don't you go talk to him? I think he's in the living room. Eh, you got it. After I take a look at this. And Roll isn't looking this way. Just a, just a peek at her diet. Huh? What is it, Mega Man? Uh, um... Nothing, Roll. Nothing. I've been reading up on some of these interactions. Well, that's... Well, that's a little horny. Which is weird, because he's got nothing to... Yeah, never mind. Huh? Roll aboard and old hover jets were used to bake jet skates. Came up with something different again. Jet skates. With these, you'll be able to move a lot faster than you can by running. Just be careful you don't get hit by cars if you use them in the city. What a wonderful little ring. Did you really find it underground? It's so nice. Why don't you keep it? You mean I can have it? Wow, thank you so much. Hey, did I just give that ring away? Oh no. I promise I'll always wear it. Oh well. We'll be at the flutter if you need us, Mega Man. I'm hoping that the flutter's around here. Yep, there it is. Wait, do I have to actually climb up in order to get into the flutter? Huh. Wait, are these actual usable stairs? No. Oh! Kind of. Huh. I mean, that's one way to handle it. Not wrong. Oh, I can actually explore. Alright, cool. 
The northern parts of the island should expect sunshine in the morning, followed by clouds in the afternoon. Those of you heading for the closer woods might want to take an umbrella along, just in case. Seems like a really bad idea to have a big heavy plant in a big heavy pot on an airship that's already crashed at least once, but eh, what do I know? Oh. oh, hi Mega Man. Amelia asked me to find out what I could about the treasure that's supposed to be buried here. This island's just got so many mysteries I don't know where to start looking. Mega Man, have you ever heard of the main gate? Yep. Oh, you have, eh? Then you probably already know this, but the largest ruin on the island is called the Main Gate and can be found near the Old City. What's unusual about it is that as far as anyone knows, there's no way to get inside. I have a theory that it's connected in some way to or with the subgate. Tell me, Mega Man, have you found a passage in the subgates that connects to the main gates? Uh, sorta kinda, yeah? Don't you make fun of me, I'm serious, I'm right. Subgate in the closer woods is some kind of key for the main gate, and I'm willing to bet anything the treasure those pirates are after is inside the main gate. They probably realize how close they and we are getting to the treasure. So don't let your guard down. Oh, one more thing, Mega Man. Have you have you heard the tale of Darth Plagueis the Wise? That's a pretty good render of sheep for a uh, PS1 game, all things considered. Strangely shaped coffin. Professor Barrow brought it out as a souvenir when he was working in a famous desert country. Oh, uh, that must be the one the guy from Godzilla, Godzilla, <laughs> Godzilla, Godzilla vs. Biollante came from. <laughs> it's a chest. Is there anything inside? Oh, a bomb schematic. Nearly wasted what would have easily been half an hour looking in the lake. For something that's probably related to this thing. What a dirty trick. What a filthy trick. It's a first aid box. But you don't really need it as long as data's around. Look at this chunky cactus. It's a cactus, but it's not yours. It's something data picked up. He says it makes a good conversation partner. <laughs> it's an antique clock. Roll gave it to you for your birthday. You better think of something to give her in return. Oh, well, I, I guess we got that handled. It's your bed. You could use a nap, but not just yet. What does Mega Man have for clothes? Nothing? Really? Okay. Here you go, Mega Man. The bomb schematic was used to make the Grand Grenade special weapon. A pretty good one. That's a pretty good name. This is another arm-mounted weapon. It allows you to shoot out even stronger grenade bombs. They're really powerful. You might even be able to use it to blow up walls inside the ruins. Oh, there you go. We just saved like a full hour's worth of looking in the blasted lake. Good grief. Oh, what's all this? Three chests? Wow, I'm sure they're all filled with great stuff and not a single one of them is booby-trapped. It's a trap box, oh no. This game is so predictable sometimes. I mean, clearly not predictable enough for me to avoid the traps, but I mean, come on. I don't know, that seems like everything. Does that seem like everything? Yeah. Yeah. Then again, to be fair, this is only the first game. This is like the Zoe 1 to Legend Zoe 2 from what I've heard. Except, this is still a fully formed game with a beginning, middle, and end, and it's not just a gigantic teaser, so... Maybe that comparison doesn't hold up the way I think it did. I don't think I can blow up the boxes. Alright, I trust you, Bats. Next time I see a trapped box, I will blow it up. I never bothered to try, so it's not like I'm speaking from a position of experience here. No fooling? Really? That actually sounds kind of sick. All right, well, I don't really have any other bright ideas, so let's just go back to the flutter and see where we can go. I know that Roll told us that we can go to a subgate from the flutter, so just to be safe, I'm gonna go and do that. Blade arm. Hmm. Not bad. Not bad. Eh. You know what? We'll stick with the grenades. Never know what else we'll need to blow up. Hmm. 
expanding the energy is a bit too rich for me right now, so... Let's just leave that alone, then. But wait, are we still in the air? How do I get down? Guess we'll just figure it out one bit at a time. It's a dresser. What kinds of things might Roll keep in her drawers? <coughs> really? Okay, never mind. Looks like a large computer. I guess I just head out the front door then. Hmm. All right, cool. Can't get any reading from inside. I want Mega Man. Are you okay? Can you see a door somewhere? Uh, every time I go ahead, it cuts off the feet. Higher prototype anthro unit ID cards. What's a prototype anthro unit? I've never heard of that before. Well, whatever that is, you need three ID cards, right? If we're lucky, you'll be able to find them inside there. Man had a hard time reading that. Three ID cards, huh? Really? From the start? Jeez. Barely walk through the door. Oh! God, I, I can tell I don't like these guys. I'll never like these guys. He said it. We all heard it. It's canon. I, I think we all know that. But that doesn't change the fact that she would also count as what Kyo called her. I mean, she calls the serve bots her kids. ID card. Something, Mega Man? I think I found an ID card. Good going. I'll go back to that. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah, they're actually naming people. Uh and there is a good game here, somewhere. All they have to do is fix this stupid camera. And the way that you move. The sliding? Unacceptable. It was the style at the time that that Reaverbot was made. Both of those are equally loathsome. You can't go wrong, and by that I mean you've already gone wrong. I feel like danger would be going down into this place, so maybe going up a bit safer. As much as I rag on the combat, I guess I could always just run from everything if it starts to get boring. Ah! Ah! This must never leave this stream. <laughs>